Even though we were not allowed to record what was said in court Tuesday during the sentencing of Sandy Nguyen, you didn't miss much. She said nothing, nothing to explain why for two years she faked her son's cancer, collecting thousands in donations. Her defense attorney called it a misunderstanding. Sandy's friends, the boy's teachers, told the court for two years the mom of four detailed the six-year-old's illness, his fight with leukemia. The organized fundraisers did everything they could to help. And still today, in unison, they said they couldn't wrap their minds around what happened. Who does that? Who makes their child believe they're dying of cancer? Who does that? Who makes the entire family believe that their, their son, their, their grandson, their nephew, their brother is dying? Like, that to me is not a mentally stable human being. A judge sentenced Sandy to 90 days of work release and five years of probation. For the people whose trust she broke, this is punishment enough. They said even though this help mission was a bust, there will be others. I think in the future, um, we just are a little more cautious and, and uh, check with the hospitals and, you know, deliver, deliver our support in a way that I think it, we, we've learned um, to follow through maybe and not just trust what you're being told by the parent. Um, right. We, we have to be a little bit more, more cautious. Absolutely. Yeah, just more cautious. Which, which is sad in today's society. You but we be, will still help. Sandy will start serving her jail time in December.